This slideshow will show you how to modify your Toyota Tacoma's 12-pin flasher to accommodate LEDs without any hyper blinking. If you do have the 12-pin, you will need to open it up and send it down manually. First, you have to remove the lower panel. To do that, you have to remove first the little tray to the lower right of the steering column. And then you'll have to gain access to a 10 millimeter bolt and by the door on the left side you'll have to remove the door trim on the bottom and also the lower left kick plate and the footrest pedal after that you can remove all the 10 millimeter bolts and pop the panel off it's connected with clips near the steering column and you'll see there will be a many buttons attached to the top of the panel go ahead and disconnect the wiring harnesses and then that will allow the panel to lie on the floor of the truck without anything being strained while you work on removing the fuse box. The flasher module is clipped onto the right side of the fuse box, so to take it off you'll need to remove the fuse box. Do that by removing the two 10mm bolts holding on the lower left clip for the fuse box, and then there's also one more 10mm bolt right by the steering column that holds it on, and then remove all the wiring harnesses. You don't really have to label them since they should only fit back where they're supposed to go. And the flash module is clipped onto the right side of the fuse box. You might have to go underneath the dashboard to try to find it. You have to clip it off. It's kind of hard to clip off and hard to see when it's in the clipped in position. Once you take it out, you have to remove the cover. It's kind of hard. You might want to wear gloves so you don't cut yourself on the plastic. And then you can see inside this particular one's a smaller flasher unit. It only has one resistor hoop. All circumstances are different, but generally you have to sand down at least half of the resistor hoop on two of the sides so a hyperblink will not occur. This test was done with only two of the bulbs on LED. Sand down more if all four of the bulbs are LED. And for reassembly just follow these instructions in reverse. The one exception is that you don't have to clip the flasher module back onto the side of the fuse box. You can kind of just let it hang. All the wires down there underneath the dashboard will keep it in place and prevent it from rattling or anything. That's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, please look at the links below in the description before leaving a comment. And once again, thank you for watching.